Crouchy, mate. You okay? How are you, mate? Yeah, good, you? Yeah. Nice to see you. Yeah, nice to see you as well, mate. What, Bristol City, Arsenal, Newcastle, Man United, Blackburn. Who was your favourite club to play for? I thought. really loved my time at Newcastle. Yeah. Uh, but I always had a dream to play for Manchester United. Mm. Do you know, I remember where I was when, when that deal happened, because I was, I, I was delivering papers at that time. Oh, be it. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. And uh, someone told me, and I said, well, it's not in the paper. They said, well, it hasn't broke yet. <laughs> well, it was big news. I know, huge news. news. I mean, look at this guy doing no. an interview. <laughs> <about that. Come> <laughs> it was massive news. Um, one of the greatest strikers of all time. Uh, it was only Alan Shearer and Wayne Rooney scored more goals in the Premier League. Do you have a favourite goal of yours? Um, I always say I enjoy them all because mm. there's quite a few of them I don't remember. He scored a lot though, so I don't know if it's <laughs> age, I think that's just, the, that's just numbers, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What about scoring, was it five, was five against Ipswich, really? Yeah. Yeah. How, yeah. How was that? I, I played in the game where Defoe did it against Wigan um, and he should have passed at least three of them to me. <laughs> <laughs> Um, did everything just go right for you that day? It was one of those days. Mm. It was one of those days, you know. To be the first player in Premier League history to get five goals. You know, mm. that, that was a great feeling as well. Your career's what spanned 20 odd years uh, playing the highest level, playing for some great clubs. Uh, I know it'd be hard for you, but can you sum up a favourite moment? 99 was pff, historical. It's yeah. something that I, I'll never, never forget. I mean, that's, that's the one point I look back in my career and I say to myself, wow, that's just amazing, you know. To go to beating Tottenham last day of the season, to mm. beating Newcastle in the FA Cup the week after. You won absolutely everything at Man United and played with some of the best players in the world. Yeah, like I said, I, I couldn't turn it down because it's what I always wanted. Mm. I think about uh, like partnerships for, I've had, and I like Jermaine Defoe, Wayne Rooney. I don't think there's ever a partnership I ever saw growing up better than, than yours and Dwight York. Mm. I put it like this way, it was, a, it was a perfect relationship. It was like meeting that special woman that you know, bang. Yeah. That's the one. Yeah, yeah. The relationship me and Dwight had on and off the football pitch. We were so comfortable in each other's company on the football pitch. We hardly even spoke. Mm. That's how comfortable we were in our movement and we yeah. know where each other were. You know, so for me, if, if I'm in front of a goal and I know he's got an opportunity to tap in, I roll it in me and tap it in. Yeah. Vice versa. Mm. So I, I wasn't trying to outdo him, he was never trying to outdo me, and that's mm. why I was fortunate to go on and achieve so much. Yeah. Okay, should we do the quick fire? Yeah, yeah, let's go. These are the hard hitting, nitty gritty questions. Yeah. Uh, inside the mind, go. <laughs> <laughs> right, Messi or Ronaldo? Messi. Andy or Andrew? I'm being called worse. Yeah. <laughs> Old Trafford or St James's Park? Oh. Old Trafford for the stadium. St. James's for the atmosphere, it's frightening. Baked beans or mushy peas? None. OK, night out or night in? At my age. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, OK, speak another language or speak to the animals? <sighs> That's a good one, that. <laughs> speak to the animals. Yeah, would you? Yeah, yeah, because yeah, you that. know what they're thinking. Yeah, yeah 100. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> Your worst habit? Quiet. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Very quiet.